So we made it to the spot. Cardiff Bay. This kind of reminds me of um, a little place in the States uh, called uh, the San Pedro Pops. Doesn't it? And also Huntington Beach. It's like a mixture of Which is where she's from. Check it out. Ain't it beautiful? Yeah. And it lights up at night too, so yeah. I know. Oh look, let's try to make it all the way to where the boats are. Yeah. Oh look at the Ferris wheel. Where is it? Oh there it is. <laughs> Made it. I'm gonna check this out. So we're gonna see what's up right here. Hey, look. <laughs> people love the camera. I know they are. That's our, sec you. our second experience, but the one in the in the projects was even uh, even better with the project babies. So that that's what I call. It was. Cool. So, oh, look. You're gonna get on the Ferris wheel. You're on by no, yourself. no. I have by a yourself. fear of heights. <laughs> I have a fear of heights. I will not do that. <laughs> Remember how it was in Long Beach? Uh, and that was like one third of the size. Yeah, so. I know. But I was terrified. I literally was crippled with fear. I know. I know what uh, crippling fear feels like. And it's one of those. <laughs> That's for sure, man. Because I, I couldn't move. My wife was laughing. I felt scared to death. And at the same time, I felt like... Um, I was gonna die. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's go get that the dome. I think I don't know a specific name. Oh yeah, that would be nice. Oh look at this right here. It's very tropical, huh? Tiki chiringuito. A little oh. tiki lounging. Hear the music? Yeah, it sounds like a. Uh, Attempting. No, it sounds like a reggae, no? Yeah. Nice. Huh. There it is in the back. Oh, and the skate park. Oh, look at this. Urban game. Look at this, guys. I'm sure this here is popping during the day. Yeah. More graph art right there. Like they're lighting up the yep, Ferris wheel. I think sunset's not for another hour here. I know. And then uh, we should go in there. Yeah, let's go. See what's up. Yeah. All right, so stay tuned for that. And here is another very popular attraction right here, which is the Cardiff Theater. Look at that. Look how massive it is. about to go in this mug see uh see what they have to offer in there here's cardiff bay at night little glimpse of Cardiff at night and as promised 
here are the urban games check it out you guys are going crazy Skating is not, but as a spectator, for sure, it's calming. Oh, I think it's like a, it's not dunking, it's shooting. Oh, it's uh, the people in uh, wheelchairs and stuff, so, yeah. That's why I was wondering why they were so low. But yeah, check it out. Pretty cool. Where was like the the high basketball court? Like the tall one. Over here, huh? Or no, over there. Too. This is Wales, guys. This is Cardiff. We got lots of activity for the kids. If you're looking to leave the states, come somewhere calm for the kids, man. I mean, Wales is uh, pretty much crime free. Just uh, from speaking to locals, the crime that occurs here is like petty crime, nothing violent like in the states. So I know a lot of people uh, in the states are trying to leave the states. They're trying to become expats in a safer, calmer country, especially with all the online working now, all the remote working. Uh, this would definitely be at the top of my list. Wales, I mean, come on. Look at that. Look at the kids having fun. Such an easy going vibe. You might say, Rich, you could get this in the States too. Yeah, but um, here, you don't have the, the PTSD having to worry about your kid's school getting shot up. You know, things like that. Being a, a victim of a senseless shooting. So, I think in the States, we just become numb to everything that goes on there. We assume the rest of the world is the way we are, but it's not, it's not. And one thing I hear a lot of Americans saying is, America is the greatest country in the world. Nine times out of 10, the people saying that have never even been out of their own city, let alone their own state, let alone their own country. So how can you judge if you've never been out of your country, right? It's just that you've been programmed to say and programmed to think, but have you really gone out and experienced the world? 
because only then can you uh, decipher what really is the best. And um, this is my 22nd country now. And I can tell you it's a beautiful, beautiful country. So stay tuned for more, all right? Wales, baby.